Come on, we're, we're clocking it, can't sir? So basically, just, what, just what for, I've done first... Just for the record, look. It's lovely and neat. It's not hollow either. What do you mean? <laughs> so basically, what I've done before is... Usually, I'd just be like... Get to there, saw it, get a nice bend. But it seems like the more, I, the, the more I've done the scoring, mm -hmm. the more it was weaker. Yeah, so, yeah. we see anyway. We see now. So um, uh, let's see if this works. So what I want to do is... Can you see how much of a bend he's getting on that? No? So what I want to do is... It's going to... It's here where it's going to... Okay. Okay. So I want to... Is there no potatoes? No, it's like I say, it's hollow, so it's, it's in the same predicament that I was on my side. And now this is the worrying part. You could get a screw in there, it's solid there if you want to get a screw in on the end and slowly pull it in. Oh, bloody hell, the tight, the tight is fine. It's going to snap here. Do you want to screw? You're hearing the creaking. Have you got a screw? Yeah, get a couple just to get one right on the end. Because it's hollow, there's nothing there. There you go. That guy. It's going to come back. Yeah, got it. Cool. So if you come over here, we're going to secure that more. If you come over here, you can see that there's no kinks there. So yeah. nice. And if you look at, to be fair, looking at both of them, sales one's better. Um, Don't be like that. It is, it is, to be fair. We'll, 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 okay. we'll be honest, but mine's a little bit more slapdash, but... No, that not work. It works, you know? So oh, this is a big ball, though. I need more money in itself. Because this is a big ball nose, it ain't gonna really matter that much. But you should get an all for it and a set square, and then that line is straight. It's, it's basically there. You can check it along. We're there. So he's basically checking if the pile is coming down straight. It's, it's, it's square. So now it's about half now. I don't have no pens. I'm sorry, I forgot. I've got. I've got a marker. Should have markers. Always got markers in my box somewhere. Not there in the van. I've got Ryan's bag and like Ryan's always got a marker in his bag as well. No, he hasn't got Yes, no? I've got one in the van. I've got loads in the van. What happened? I might have to go get one. I don't know my things. <laughs> but I've got them, that's the thing. Let me go to the van and get a couple markers. That's fine, so we're going to mark up our reference, our reference point and um, so when we're putting the step back on after sewing, we know where our points are. Right, bring the... Uh, have you got water? Water. water. Yeah. It's got everything. <laughs> You 
lot can see everything, innit? Yeah, you can see everything. So as it comes round, you probably have a seam here, a seam there, and um, yeah, that's about it. I'll have a pen. Let me just let me just get that in the video. Oh, where is it? Oh, there it is. Yeah, yeah, that's the company. So he cut this, put it back together, taped it all up, glued it all up, and now you've got a mini mini kicker. Huh? It's like 13 inches. You know that. Give or take. Nice. side up as well and mark where the bend starts on the carpet. And you can see. Yeah. And then also you're gonna to want to put a mark just here as a reference to where to stop sewing. Alright so do you wanna come all the way around? Do you wanna meet in the middle? Do you wanna see if we meet in the middle? You can do it, Let's see if you meet him in. Alright, let's go. Let's see if you've got a steady hand. Right. I'm in. I feel like I'm harsher. No, man, I'm confident in our collaboration. We'll see how it goes. Set up because it's set up right. We're basically on each other. <laughs> Easy, bro. Yeah, 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 none of that, mate. Yeah. Edit, edit, edit. Right, okay. Cut that out. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time for that. Right, so we're good. We're ready to rock and roll. Right, so flip this out. Over. Right, we've got our reference points. So, what I don't know if you can see in the video, we've got that angle. You know what? Let me get the video. You start cutting out. There's only one man to cut it anyway. Yeah, but let's just get that angle there. You got it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, on a normal ball nose, it ain't going to come in square. So, you get yourself a set square, and you put that in there, and whatever this measurement here is missing, it's normally around about 10 mil, you've got to deduct that. So, how that works, we got, yeah, we got it on the right. So, you get a 10 measure. So, for reference, it'd be, say, here at the end of the ball. This is a, you know, you're gonna get one of these ever. So, you'd normally go to here. So you'd measure, so that's 32 centimeters from the start of the bend to where I need to finish the side the area. We've got straight. Yeah, uh, top lid. They're underneath their extendable. So you want to go 32 centimeters off the ground. We're here for Alright, so we know where we want to finish if we was doing a normal ball nose. We're going to go further, but I know that's the end of my soap. What's happened? Where have I gone to the straight edge? I broke it. You've got to keep yourself on these. You're just brilliant. They're expensive. That's 45 pounds, RWS salmon, all in touch spaces. So with us, we want to come off straight because it's straight. 
but I'll give you a for instance if it's a different ball nose. So you come off straight like that and then you do your deduction. So your deduction is there, 10 centimetres, and then all you do is just bring your line to there and do, I'll do it in pencil just so I can see that deduction. It means a lot because what it happens is if you don't do that deduction, it gets really puffy around here, doesn't yeah. it? And you can't lose you it. You want a tailor fit, you want a snug. Yeah. So that's my side done. So I've got to do these. And you see our reference points where we've done that, where we've done this, where I've done this, where that comes up to here. When we're putting it back on, we know that needs to go there and we can mark up all of these points and then. Well, yeah, that, that, that's how it gets back on, basically. So it's good to have a, a selection of colours. No, I've got severe OCD. Everything's in a box. For, and look, there's a marker in the sewing box because I need a marker for the sewing box. So yeah, just, you're not going to get a much better match than that. Just trying to find the end. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. If you want a needle. Huh? I just want to put this back on, I just want to have a look quickly if I can do anything that makes my life a bit easier. So, mine's. There's my reference point, so I'll mark that up. up. And my mark's there. I'm basically where I want to be. You out of your own, or do you want to go? Yeah? That's in the car, yeah? Yeah? One point, so. It's a little bit. You put it towards you. That's no, right here. I can go. Yeah, yeah, I can live with that. Yep. Cool. I've got a nice cut here as well. So Sweet. we're going to probably do the join like horizontal. It'll be easier. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is the fun part now. Yeah. And you've got a smaller one. Oh, the thinner one. You know, if you ain't got the needles on one, this is where you're going to have a problem. That's a chrome needle. That is a chrome needle. Chrome needle. Like a thinner one. You know that? Thinner one. You've got a thinner one there. You've got a thinner one there. That's, that's even thinner. But that's enough for me. You know what? I don't know how this looks on the video here. Yeah? But this carpet is so tough. It's thick, man. Right. I can't get my flipping needle in. And he's got a push-up. Does, does help having the same arm. Huh? To start off with, it's really, they're really uncomfortable. Like, you know, I was sitting on my hand, but you know, it's, it's in the way, and it, but you just get used to it. Like anything. Like, look at this. I'm proper pushing. I've got a pair of pliers, I've got a pair of pliers. See, but when I see what I do, see the video, I'm just pushing it palm because it's got like a really hard bit there. You could probably make one up with it, just give a bit of carpet if you wanted to. No, this is a little thing that you've got, it's alright, it works. This is why it's important to have double tools. But I'm not give you. I'll let you off on that one. Because um who has a double bloody stitching palm thing? Well especially on left hand isn't it? So. Firstly, yeah, look at the bloody needles bent. Yeah, watch this. 
this is a left hand that's all look how hard i got a push for that to go in i am now so disappointed that i want to say anything and then i got to bloody pull it out with pliers and this is what I'm going through right now because he's giving me a flipping ding donkey kong needle. No, he's got he had the same choice. I've got loads of needles of the same, I've got duplicates of the same. He chose that needle. <laughs> <laughs> you can go away now. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Cut around now. That's my side. Uh, I prep the underlay because Sal's still sewing. Again. I'm going to do this part separately up there because we're going to put, probably put the join in there or it might come down vertically or it might come upwards. Don't know how we're going to sew it yet. Might sew it down there or we might sew it there yet. See how we feel. Uh, mine's been dexed and it's dry because I've had the heater on it. So look at that sewn, you know, looks pretty smart. But Sal's one's a lot tighter than mine. Looking at it. But, you know, both gonna do a good job. Oh, sorry. <laughs> we can only hope. 